Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be using this foam board and these Dollar Tree mirrors to make a glam tic-tac-toe board game. I'm placing these nine mirrors onto my foam board and then I'm gonna trace around them with my silver Sharpie and then cut it out with my X-Acto knife. For this next step, I'm using a second foam board to cut out the exact same piece that I already had. I'm using some of this diamond wrap to cover up the edges. I'm using eight of these crystal clear drawer knobs for the legs to my tic-tac-toe board. Now I'm cleaning my mirrors off and next I'm using these LED lights that I already had on hand. I'm using these to add more definition to my tic-tac-toe board. If you are going to recreate this project, make sure that the lights are facing upwards. I'm gluing the battery pack to the bottom and I'm making sure that I don't put any glue on the side where I will have to change the batteries. Now I'm using more of that diamond wrap to cover up all the lines on my board game. I'm using some of these clear gems to make the O's and the X's. I'm just putting a small amount of glue in between the gems so they can stick together, but not too much because I don't want it seeping through the front.
I'm using a small amount of glue for the excess as well. And once I was done with this step, I removed any excess glue strings, cleaned all my mirrors off, and then this is how it turned out. This DIY tic-tac-toe board game was very easy to make. All items are from the Dollar Tree except for the crystal clear drawer knobs. This is perfect for family fun night or your everyday home decor. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. For project number two, I'm just making a storage box to store my X's and my O's. I just used that same foam board and some mirror tiles to trace and cut out my squares. For this last step, I'm going to add this crystal clear drawer knob to the center of the top of my box and then once I removed any excess glue strings, cleaned all my mirrors off, I then had something that looked like this. I'm loving this week's projects. This storage box goes perfect with my new tic-tac-toe board. But tell me what y'all think. Please like, comment, and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, Hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.